Good morning, Mrs. Murder here. Did you see Squeeze Me? That's our new video for today. And if you want to have some fun, some wicked fun, and still have about a mystery, murder mystery, you can always count on Hyacinth. He writes from Florida. He has a wicked sense of humor and a pretty bizarre plot here. Squeeze Me, of course, is has got to be about a boa constrictor. And so the greater part of the book is in concerned with trying to locate this boa con constrictor, who they believe has swallowed a, an old lady from a, one of these parties that, uh, that the president and his wife and a lot of the upper... 1% were, were attending as a fundraiser, and she went had had a little too much to drink, and tipsy she went out from the party and walked down to the pond and disappeared. We're involved with an, an interesting person who used to be a veterinarian, and she, uh, she is taxed with trying to locate this and trap this huge snake. So... If you aren't opposed to snakes, and if you want to solve a mystery with her, uh, pick up Hyacinth Squeeze. You know that this author was was a, a writer for many years for newspapers, and he's written all of his a lot of his books, and received awards for the Dilly Award, and a lot of awards for his books. They're all about Florida. And they're all taken out of newspaper accounts because he worked for a newspaper. And you'll find that they're, uh, they're intriguing. He has different, different plots. <clears throat> and the characters that are humorous and to be taken with a grain of salt. We are going to have, I'm going to have three books that I'll be video, videotaping, reviewing. And all three of them are different kind of silly but also very well written and interesting plots and characters and I think I think you might enjoy it if you want a relief from heavier reading you can pick up Squeeze Me or one of Hyacinth's books if you if you care to set foot in Florida in these books uh, the most bizarre things happen there especially in his books so that's Hyacinth's Squeeze Me, and since I got the book on Kindle, I put this photo up so that you could see what the book looks like. <laughs> it jumps out at you. Have fun. Later now.